Hey, what's up guys? Welcome for another episode of Kyoto RN and I am here at Washington DC to go and see a little bit of heaven here. It's, it's the Washington Auto Show. Get the scan here. So let's go upstairs. Here it is. I think we're starting at the luxury section here, the auto shop. Ooh. Okay, so we are back and I'm here in the auto shop. And uh, it's a good thing that I am here, right away in the luxury area, which I like. Here, let's uh, check out the very collectible cars. Here, we get a Ferrari. I like this car because this was featured in uh, the Miami Vice, but it was white, but red is still fine for me. <laughs> the new one here, the F40 here, it's a million dollar car. Love it. Of course, we also have a classic here. I don't want to take any pictures. I like a sports car. Let's find one. One of my loves. Motorcycles. One of the most exciting cars last year is 
the new Toyota Supra, but this one here has art on it. All covered up. I think they're working on it for now. Look at those wheels. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is uh, one of the sections here. Actually, this building is really big. So uh, there's an exit there, and we'll go to the other side, okay? So let's go. Going down. Okay. I think I'm gonna have the disease later on. <laughs> Okay, so this area here, I think I can go inside of it. Okay, currently we're here at the GM area. And let's check out the cars. Get the Equinox. There's the SUVs here. Mm -hmm. You want to know the Camaro SUV? This is it. The 2020 Blazer. Let's go inside. I like this. See? All Camaro inspired uh, interior. Sunroof. Interior. It's actually 2021. Another one with the red paint. Check the Bolt EV. 2020. This car is actually have, uh, you know, having a good review. But then nobody's buying it because Tesla is uh, taking up the market. But this one is actually a good car. Go inside and check it out. 
it's electric. Ah. I'm not sure about this material here. It feels like a paper. Especially this one here that you know uh, takes away the the blandness of the interior. Okay, let's move on. And of course, everybody's waiting for this uh, mid-engine Chevrolet Corvette. Get a hydrogen fuel car, which is the Toyota Mirai. important thing is actually this tank here it's gonna make sure that the hydrogen is sealed and it won't leak you know so those other things we need to uh, check we like some cars and uh, yep. the car we have the new one actually here 2020 Mirai But there's a sticker there. It's still on a prototype. It looks nice. I like the uh, wheels. And for sure, I want to go inside this one here. Of 
Yes. And they have a red one here too. And we get the Toyota 86 of course because we're in the Toyota section. The RAV4 Prime. We are in the Ford section. Ford. It's gonna be Mustang and F 150 Raptor. Can I play the game? Just like in Chicago? An interesting trim too! Nobody's looking at it. We are here in the Jeep area. Let's check out the Jeeps. I want to see the Rubicon. A short one. I want to see it. Looks like it's less busy here. It's the Gladiator. It's Dutch time. This also has an SRT power chiller. Now that uses air conditioning or refrigerant to help lower those air intake temperatures and of course increase the flow. Also an enhancing handling and performance as well. And when it comes to slow down, you guys can see these massive two-piece front rotors. Six piston caliper rumble bridge in, now making it 717. Now the engineer Oh, 
away from that loud area there. And I'm, I'm here in Rem. Actually, like the Ram 1500, and I want the short bed. Those wheels. Needs a liner. Go up, it's gonna high. Ooh, this is big. Okay, let's close the door. See what's inside here. Oh, big area here in the middle. And this big tablet screen. Beside each other, of course, right? And uh, these are all the like this uh, car brand is uh, this Pacifica. I love Pacifica. Uh, family vehicle where you can uh, carry a lot of the things. And what I like in this uh, car here is because there's a seat there in the second row that you can take out by putting it under your under the floor but I cannot really do it here because there's a lot of people and we got the 300 still I don't know why they keep on uh, making this car still I guess a lot of people still buying this car it's a huge car actually and Fiat will never be available without the 500 See the inside. I always wanted to have one too, but the Abarth trim. But they say this uh, car uh, quality is not good. Okay, so I'm still uh, in the uh, Ford area. We uh, got some uh, small SUVs here, and um, we have one here. It's the Echo Sport. I really like this car too. It's not good here in America. It should be in, uh, in Asia. This will be a good fit. It's small, small car, doesn't go fast, but it looks nice because it's an SUV. And uh, 
Yeah, probably it's cheap. Hopefully it's cheap. Uh, I know it's not. We are back in Toyota, but it's in the truck area where Tacoma is. Yep. I heard about this extension before. I don't know if it's a good idea. I don't really use trucks all the time, but it's up to you. We also have the CHR, so I apologize if uh, there's a lot of people, you know, the situation, you know, so. Uh, do the walk around. I like the Encore and Tahoe. Let's find one here. This is the new Envision. Bigger than the Encore, but doesn't appeal to me. lights with this uh, trim here. Okay, so I am done with uh, this floor here. We're gonna go to the uh, lower one and uh, we'll see what's uh, there. I'm gonna walk straight here to get Loy and Cairo. So I'm gonna stand here, Mark E. Hatchback, oh, Chevrolet Sonic RS. Let's go inside, let's check it out. Hey, hey, hey. Mama, you like this? RS trim. It's nice. You know, for the young adults. Okay, let's go on the next lower floor.
Okay, so there's uh, more exhibits here. This is the third one, so let's go. Oh, did I miss the turn? <laughs> I missed the turn. It's gonna go there. We have Moines area here. Get the Volkswagen. It's uh, her car. The GTI. It's the regular goal. So for everybody, if you want a hatchback, this is it. GTI and it should be red. I like this one. So we are inside the uh, Kia Nero, and uh, actually, this car is also uh, a good car. They got a good review for this. Uh, uh, SUV, a crossover SUV. Simple outlines here. Materials are soft molded plastics, but better than the plastic. You know, they're gonna hard plastic. Materials are good. Let's see the leather there. I like the center console. And with this new shifter now, heated seats, fan, parking is uh, electronic already. Let's check out the other cars. There's three row uh, this year here. Kia Toyota. Actually, this car has a lot of technologies that the other uh, luxury cars doesn't have, and it's a Kia. Here at the back, you see the space here. So this is the third row, and uh, the material really nice. It's like a luxury car, and everybody's crazy about it. For a Kia. This SUV here, I think, is for the younger uh, adult because of the red trim. I like the exhaust. Another coming car, the Seltos.
at the Nissan area. Let's check it out. Let's go inside. Mm -hmm. Okay. Feels like a Nissan. We got the row here, which is the best-selling uh, SUV of uh, Nissan and the other cars here in their lineup including the skips Murano My first car in America is actually a Nissan Versa and I'm still looking for it. Where are they? Are they having one here? Unfortunately, I haven't seen any Versa, but I do see this. The Wonder Hall, full of people, of course. Can Am, Riker, and of course, the other one. Love this very much. So to you, Dwayne, this is for you. We got games. Dad happy blue spring and an older man playing with her on the back. here in Mazda and if it's Mazda it's gonna be Miata we get the 630 and the RF here on the side The news is uh, discussing about Iran, but we're not going to use this. Uh, okay. Now this is my face, and this is the new. Defender. We got the Villar here. We got my favorite Evoke. Here is to take a note. You are 
uh, area and then of course if it's a Cura we have to have the NSX and uh, we got a yellow one here and uh, this car here still uh, is around a hundred thousand dollars but I wish I can uh, want those sweepstakes and we have the race version here all carbon fiber mm -hmm. Those skirts there. Here, including uh, the TLX and other versions. The brand has been a, uh, a regular Ford for me. But now they are stepping up their game and all their cars are all luxury. Looks like metal but it's actually plastic too. But look at that big SUV. Beside the Lincoln here, we got a Ferraris, and of course, there's a Countach at the end. There it is. So this is a Lambo. In my uh, 80s era, together with the Ferraris. <laughs> I'm just gonna let you know that it's not my collection, okay? Maybe soon. Look at those rare hands. My goodness. This is Kurt Karma here, which is not doing well, unfortunately. It's a nice car. And a bond car. We have a Ferrari here and the GT40. Very iconic car. I don't know if it's the original one. And this one here too. Here in the Lexus area. And I was in the LC500, which I uh, featured uh, two years ago. Bought it uh, probably uh, by the RCS. This is the LC500. It looks uh, futuristic actually even uh, now, but you can buy it. Uh, inside look at the inside Ooh. my goodness oh all leather here Ooh. the knob is a uh, lot bit more play with it but this is a car show Looks like metal, but it's also plastic. We are here in Cadillac. Volvo here, and we want to check the XC40. It is a good, uh, busy.
And we are here in the Alpha. Oh, the show I have was uh, only the the car, and now we have the Stelvio. It's been uh, available for like two years already. This is the first time I've seen the car in person. Oh, oh. Oh. Here. <laughs> okay, so soft mode plastics. Good. Okay. So uh, that is nice, and uh, of course we want to put the Junior. Which is still available uh, in a dealership near you. But this is not the portfolio. Genesis here. Brand of Hyundai. We are here in Honda. Ooh, this is the R. Type R. power. light chassis. With a lot of uh, wings, for sure. Have a car reviewer here. I just don't know his channel. But yeah, he is. He has a lot of uh, good uh, stuff for <laughs> video recording, uh, like me. We got the venue here. This spoiler. So this is the regular Veloster. I like the exhaust there. You know. Seats are nice. It's uh, gray. When I was uh, heading for uh, America and I see a review in YouTube, and this is the first car I saw. And I still love it too. Guys, uh, thank you very much for uh, watching this uh, auto show. Uh, I'm looking forward for the next one. It's been a while since the last time I did, uh, you know, this kind of uh, activity. But yes, beside the Kona and uh, Ionic, I'm gonna end this video and uh, stay tuned for uh, for more videos. And uh, hope you have some. Uh, we're gonna have some more uh, car reviews for 2020. So thank you very much for watching. Until next time, bye bye.